For centuries, we Earthlings have dreamed of learning about cultures and civilizations from other planets. Ever since astronomers discovered that the light phenomena in the sky are stars and planets, speculation arose. Are we alone in the universe? Or are there other planets out there that could support life? In recent years, thanks to modern technology, astronomers have been able to go searching for answers in other solar systems. Using powerful telescopes, they've discovered thousands of exoplanets and some of them look very promising for the existence of extraterrestrial life. In this video, we'll be exploring the top 10 planets that could host alien life according to NASA. We'll be looking at their size, their distance from their star, and whether or not they have the potential to support liquid water. The key ingredient for life as we know it. So buckle up, space fans, and get ready for a thrilling ride through the cosmos. Our first stop takes us to Proxima Centauri b, a planet that's practically in our backyard, cosmically speaking. It orbits Proxima Centauri, a red dwarf star just 4.2 light years away in the constellation Centaurus. Red dwarfs are cooler than our sun, so their habitable zones are closer in. Proxima Centauri b sits in its star's habitable zone. It's likely tidally locked, with one side always facing the star. This could lead to extreme temperature differences, but life is adaptable. We've found creatures thriving in extreme environments on Earth. Proxima Centauri b is incredibly similar to Earth. Its proximity and characteristics make it a target for future exploration. Our next destination takes us to the constellation Aquarius, where we find the star Trappist-1. Trappist-1 is an ultra-cool dwarf star, much smaller and cooler than our Sun. It's home to seven Earth-sized planets and three of them, including TRAPPIST-1e, are in the habitable zone. TRAPPIST-1e is particularly exciting because it's one of the most Earth-like exoplanets we've found. The James Webb Space Telescope is poised to unlock even more secrets of this intriguing world. Let's journey to a star system just 12.2 light-years away in the constellation Canis Major. There we find Leuton b, a rocky exoplanet orbiting the red dwarf star Leuton's star. It's one of the closest potentially habitable exoplanets we've ever discovered. In 2017, SETI sent a message to Leuton b, beaming a powerful radio signal towards this planet. We're talking about sending a message across trillions of miles to a planet we know very little about. Even if there is intelligent life on Leuton b, there's no guarantee they'll receive our message, let alone understand it but there's always a chance, however slim, that we might just get a response. The signal contained information about Earth and humanity, including our understanding of mathematics, music, and even the structure of DNA. If someone out there is listening, they'll get a glimpse into what it's like to be a human on this pale blue dot we call home. Our search for life now takes us about 217 light years away to the constellation Aquarius, where we find the intriguing exoplanet K272e. This rocky world, discovered in 2016 by the Kepler Space Telescope, orbits a red dwarf star called K272. It orbits within its star's habitable zone, potentially supporting liquid water on its surface. K272e is significantly closer to its star than Earth is to the Sun completing an orbit in just under 24 Earth days. While K272e receives more radiation than Earth, it's still within the realm of possibility for liquid water to exist. We don't know if it has an atmosphere, and if so, what it's composed of. But the fact that it orbits within its star's habitable zone makes it an intriguing target for future observations. KA272e remains a fascinating candidate in our search for extraterrestrial life. Let's set course for the Gliese 667 system, just 22 light years away in Scorpius. This system has three stars, but Gliese 667 cc, a super Earth, stands out. Gliese 667 cc is at least 3.7 times Earth's mass. It orbits in the habitable zone, possibly supporting liquid water. Gliese 667 c is a cooler, dimmer, red dwarf star. Gliese 667 cc completes an orbit in just 28 Earth days. It's likely tidally locked, with one side always facing the star. Life thrives in extreme environments on Earth, so who knows what could evolve on Gliese 667 cc. 
Our cosmic journey takes us 17.5 light years away to the constellation Leo, where we encounter GJ 3323b, another fascinating super Earth with the potential for life. This exoplanet, discovered in 2017, orbits the red dwarf star GJ 3323, and it's about twice the mass of Earth. GJ 3323b is a warm super-Earth, meaning it orbits closer to its star than the Earth does to the Sun, but it's still within the habitable zone. Some scientists believe that warm super-Earths like GJ 3323b could be even more hospitable to life than Earth-sized planets. They have a larger surface area, which means more room for oceans, continents and diverse ecosystems to evolve. We still have a lot to learn about GJ 3323b, including whether it has an atmosphere and, if so, what that atmosphere is composed of. Its status as a warm super-Earth within the habitable zone makes it a prime target for future observations. Let's venture just 12.5 light-years away to the constellation Aries, where we find the Tea Garden star system, home to two potentially habitable planets, Tea Garden B and Tea Garden C. These planets orbit Tea Garden star, a red dwarf star that's much smaller and cooler than our sun. Tea Garden B, the inner of the two planets, orbits within its star's habitable zone, making it a prime candidate for the search for extraterrestrial life. Because Tea Garden star is so dim, Tea Garden B receives only about 60% of the light that Earth receives from the Sun. Some scientists believe that Tea Garden B may be tidally locked to its star, with one side always facing the star and the other side in perpetual darkness. This tidal locking could create extreme temperature differences between the two hemispheres of the planet. Life is incredibly adaptable, and it's possible that unique and resilient life forms could have evolved to thrive in the twilight zone of Tea Garden B. Let's revisit the TRAPPIST-1 system, located about 40 light years away in the constellation Aquarius. We've already talked about TRAPPIST-1e, but its neighbour TRAPPIST-1d is just as fascinating, especially for those who love the idea of ocean worlds. TRAPPIST-1d is slightly smaller than Earth, but much denser. Scientists believe that TRAPPIST-1d could be a water world, a planet with a significant portion of its mass made up of water. We're talking about a planet that could be completely covered in a vast global ocean that could be hundreds of miles deep. Imagine that, an entire planet covered in water. It's enough to make any oceanographer or marine biologist drool with excitement. We don't know for sure if TRAPPIST-1D is a water world. It could also have a rocky surface with a thick atmosphere or even a layer of ice. But the possibility of a planet completely covered in water is too tantalizing to ignore. Our next stop takes us just 12 light years to the constellation Horologium, where we encounter GJ 1061 C. This exoplanet, discovered in 2019, orbits the red dwarf star GJ 1061, and it's about 1.7 times the mass of Earth. GJ 1061 C is located in its star's habitable zone, making it a prime candidate for the search for life. It completes an orbit in just over six and a half Earth days. A year on GJ 1061C is shorter than a week here on Earth. GJ 1061C remains a compelling candidate in our search for extraterrestrial life. Our final destination takes us 1,200 light years away to the constellation Lyra, where we find Kepler 442b, a super Earth that's captured the imaginations of astronomers and space enthusiasts alike. This exoplanet, discovered in 2015 by the Kepler Space Telescope, is about 1.3 times the size of Earth, and it orbits a star that's slightly cooler and smaller than our Sun. Kepler 442b, is located within its star's habitable zone, potentially supporting liquid water on its surface. Some scientists have even called it a superhabitable planet, suggesting that it might be even more suitable for life than Earth. We don't know for sure what the conditions are like on Kepler 442b. We don't know if it has an atmosphere, and if so, what that atmosphere is composed of. Its location in the habitable zone, its size and its potential for hosting liquid water make it a prime target for future observations. The search continues, so there you have it, 10 tantalizing planets that could potentially harbor life beyond Earth. 
From the scorching heat of Kepler-78b to the potential water world of TRAPPIST-1d, these exoplanets remind us that our universe is full of strange and wonderful possibilities. As we continue to explore the cosmos, we're finding more and more evidence that planets like our own are not the exception, but rather the rule. And with new telescopes and technologies coming online all the time, we're getting closer than ever to answering the age-old question, are we alone? If you enjoyed this journey through the cosmos, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to Simply Space for more mind-blowing explorations of the universe. And be sure to hit that notification bell so you never miss an episode. Keep looking up, space fans.